Welcome to lesson two. How do you make sure you collaborate and manage your brand effectively while working remotely? Many of us are working from home, which can pose challenges to collaboration and communications in brand management. To provide you with some tools and tricks so you can be more efficient while managing your brand remotely, we are sharing our tips and best practices in this lesson. Most of the time, when a remote team asks for your input, you don't have the time or capacity to answer them directly. Think of questions about the correct layout for a presentation, where to find certain images or other specific requests. Wouldn't it be easier if these teams could find this stuff themselves very easily without your manual interference? Here are our six solutions for common problems that arise from remote brand and team management. Use a cloud or SaaS solution. Whatever system you choose to use for managing your brand assets, make sure to use an online cloud solution instead of an on-premise solution for making marketing material available to colleagues. With a cloud or SaaS solution, everyone is able to log in whenever and wherever they are, 24-7, and collaboration is therefore not dependent on the timing of when a colleague in a different time zone is working or when they are working remotely away from the office. Make sure only up-to-date brand assets are available. Make sure that only the most recent versions of files are available to your colleagues. This goes for pictures, videos, but also for your other visual brand collateral. Colleagues should be able to easily find the most recent logo, fonts, or brand colors without having to search Google for them. Make assets available to specific teams only. Make sure that files are only available to the specific teams that need them. In other words, make sure that access is limited to the team that needs the files. Think, for instance, about the sales, marketing, and HR departments. They do not need to know what's going on in the other departments, so communication could be more effective and more directly applicable to them if you follow these best practices of restricting availability of assets to specific teams only. Make assets available to certain locations or regions. The same applies for availability tailored to different locations, countries, or regions. Make sure that files are only available for that specific location, so the different locations or regions won't use the files meant for other locations. When you work with different countries, you probably also have different marketing strategies for these areas. Therefore, it's usually not a great idea if one country uses marketing material from the other because it could hurt your brand. Enable your team to stay on brand. Make sure that teams know how to create on-brand marketing material themselves. This means they should know your brand guidelines and how to use them. This tip includes the use of templates, which you can use to let them know where the logo should be in a document and where text can be placed. Create an approval workflow. Lastly, be sure you can check the marketing materials that have been created by your colleagues. If you are not able to check these, chances are those materials are not on brand, which can also end up hurting your brand image. So there you have it. These were the six tips that we wanted to share with you in this lesson. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one.